Hello and welcome back to Agarian Skies with TLB. Okay, Mr. Big Reactor. It's time for an upgrade. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna make this efficiently. Well, we don't have so much fuel inside, but still 4,000 per tick there. So we're probably gonna need this cyanide here. And we're gonna make a turbine. So let's make... let's go to crafting and see what we need. Big reactors. Big raccoons. <laughs> so let's search for this. So, reactor creative. Okay, that's that's wrong, right? That's creative. Turbine housing. Reactor glass. I think they work for turbine glass. Okay, they're slightly different. So, just make some hardened glass. Just uh, make a stack of that. S start producing that. Um, turbine housing. So we need steel and graphite and cyanide. This song is also really good. So how much steel do we have? 33. I think it's time to heat up this sucky block again it's a broken block okay let's do it two stacks of iron and graphite as well I wouldn't think we would need more graphite charcoal right charcoal craft some more charcoal 192 and graphite just craft uh, there we go some graphite There we go. Steel. Just pour that shit out. It's gonna take some time to heat up though. Why are you not pouring out by the way? Oh, because there's a... Uh, uh, iron inside. Can I suck it out then? Did you drain it? That's steel, good. Okay, get some steel out. It's heating up. So we need... Um, let's get some sand. All kinds of things we need here. Gunpowder, sand... Redstone. I hope these guys are more efficient. I really do. Shit. Just regular iron there. That's BS. Ooh, 11 blocks steel blocks. So let's see how many turbine houses we can do. So what do we need first? Big reactors. Okay, in graphite. So we have the regular reactor, right? Cyanite reprocessor. What do we need that for? To make fuel again? I'm very tempted to see what this block can do. Yellowium. Cyanite reprocessor. What are we missing for that one? Oh, reactor casings. There we go. Cyanide reprocessor. Turbine ro rotor bearing. We need one of those. Turbine rotors. Two. Rotor bearing. Oh man, we need turbine casings. Probably need a bunch of these actually. 64 is a good start. 100. Oh, that's probably good. Probably we need even more actually. Are you make, still making graphite? I'm not sure. Uh, reactor coolant port. So this is what we need, I think. And this will switch our reactor. Let's make some more of these. Ah, shit. 
Need more graphite. Is there a queue? Are they set to be doing the same? Charcoal and... Now we're missing obsidian. For that shit. I'm thinking that maybe they are set to the same... Where the hell... Here. Now here we're pulverizing. Ah, graphite and charcoal are set to the same furnace. So that's pretty fucking stupid. Oh yeah, yeah, we're making charcoal out of rubber wood. I was getting confused there. What the fuck? So I'm not sure how big we want this. We need to rector coolant first, right? Charcoal. I think we can make some kind of... Um, we can start a little. So dig out the floor. Do we want to leave one space again? Yeah, one walking space. That would be good. So big ass turbine on this floor here. It's happening. So one to one from the wall. One from each wall. Let's see how big we need this to be. Okay. It's probably gonna be uh, quite big. Shit, we're gonna need a lot of materials. Maybe even more than I anticipated. Let's see here. Okay. Let's see how many would we need. It's already quite a lot. They look pretty good. We can start with these walls. One, two, three, four, five, six. Might need seven. This is something I'm not sure about. Do we want reactor turbine glass or do we want... Alright. Whew. Turbine, what can we do with the turbine? We can turn them into glass anyway. So we can... How easy are they to uh, remove? So we can just plunk them down. Or actually we can calculate. Uh, 7 by 7, so we need more here. That's gonna leave us with 5 inside. Oh, this is not 7 by 7 this is long as fuck. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Shit. I think 7 by 7 is good though. Or 7. 7 in width. Not in length. And then 5. And then 2 rotor blades on each. This is going to be massive. Some temporary torches here, maybe. Okay, the big reactor is coming. It's happening. Uh, let's see. So we want reactor coolant port. Still no more graphite. Dude, man. I'm gonna hook you up somewhere else. Here. There you are. And you too. Just get in there. Speed it up, man. Okay, well now we're making graphite. 
how are we on the steel? It's boiling up. Can we? get this back into the system can't I just suck this up as well yeah suck the steel up and now the steel is on top and then we switch a roux and we send down iron so we don't have to remove any blocks oh five more steel good There we go, 45 steel. Okay, so this is how it's gonna work. And now we have to do the math, I think, if I understand this mod correctly. We do a coolant port. What? You're missing a bucket. That's tricky. Do one coolant port here. And we need some yellorium. Six of those guys. So, reactor. Do I want to put in this fuel right now? Is it full? No. That's about full. So 8.9 basically, and now we're gonna do this shit. We're gonna break this shit. So we're gonna change the interface of this dude completely, I think. So let's say let's nine, 9,000 flux per tick. Fuel reactivity. Higher levels of radiation reduce fuel burnup. 400% seems good. Um. Okay, so now we're just gonna send milli buckets. Um. Why can't I send anything then? Is it because we have the liquid in there? Maybe we have to send in water first. Status offline. Activate reactor. Whoa. That's not good. So we need to... That overheated. So we need to cool the reactor there. Deactivate the reactor. So we need some water system here. How can we make water over here? Where do we want to produce water? Um, uh, I'm getting confused. Somewhere nice where we can produce water. You know, we're gonna turn you back into a normal reactor. And activate you again. And let you run a little there. And we're gonna make some water. Let's see if we can. Um... I wonder how. Maybe we need many coolant ports. First off, let's craft some uh, aqueous accumulators, I think. How many would we need? Let's go start with four, maybe. Let's see where we can do this. Oh, shit. 
Okay. Okay, we got four of these guys. Need some water buckets. Ah, oh, we just get some water somewhere else. Where can we do this setup where it's not bothering us? Uh, I think I know where actually. Do we have any cobble? Yeah, we do have cobble. Let's go to the reactor. Here somewhere. Maybe here? Let's think about this a little. So where should the water be then? The water should come... No, actually we just need it... Let me think. We smash this. Okay, and then we hook up some more cobble. We can actually do it all the way over here if we want to. Let's see, one, two. I think we want to do it over here. Okay. So we're gonna hook these guys up. Can I do this efficiently? How do we do this the best? Is it just like this maybe? They need the water on two sides, right? Just hook them up like that. And we can have two more. Uh, that's gonna work. Yes, that's gonna work. So it's expandable. Oh, fuck me. I mean here. Okay. They have input. They... what? Huh? Am I building the right machine here? Oculus accumulator. Yeah, this should be correct. Start here. Is that all the cobble? What the fuck? Oh, here's a few more. Uh, let's make um, some water. I brought water, right? Yeah. Start with uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, temporarily destroying this. Whoa, where is it? Fucking scared me. We could have had it here. Uh, okay, that means that we can actually put more layers on top of these guys. Oh, we're making a mess out of our house. Why are you inside the wall? How the fuck did I build this? What? How the hell did I build this? Isn't that gonna be visible through here then? No, maybe not. Whatever. Uh, we can always rearrange it later. 
So let's see if well, I don't like flowing water, so we're gonna do two more. There we go, and here. Come on, let's pick it up, dude. And just two buckets here. We'll sort it out later. They have water, they have water. So that's four of these guys. So which way do we want to... So we want fluid ducts. We'll try with fluid ducts first. We don't have any fluid ducts. We send it... Where do we want to send it? We can send it in the bottom here, actually. No, we probably want to bring it up here somewhere. Do we want servos or do we want... Uh, I think we want some servos. Three, four, and duct. Where did I put our liquid ducts? Or fluid ducts, I mean. It's a dilemma. Reactor. Hook you up. Can bring you up. We can bring you up here, actually. I mean, doesn't really matter. No, not there. Fuck. There we are. Ah, output is on the top right. Oh, so there's water in here now, right now. Okay, good. So I'm gonna break this again and put down the reactor coolant. And put get the water inside. But there we already have a coolant in there. Is that gonna matter? So steam is building up. 120 millibuckets. Eighty millibuckets, but it's not on. What? Why is it heating up like that? Eighty what? We made 8,000. Maybe it has to do something with this cryotium in here. Coolant. So that's water coming in. How do we make steam coming out then? Uh, big reactor. Cyanide reprocessor. Reactor computer, access port, now maybe I can change this, no it doesn't seem like it, I can access this one though, outlet, output, Steam, water, 80 millibuckets per tick. That can't be right. We're making, should be much, much more. Uh. Hmm. I don't understand. How do I remove steam from the reactor then? 
water coming in. Maybe it's the same port. The coolant port, the excess steam. So I think we need our we need a one more coolant here. How does the cyanide reprocessor work then? What does it make? Is it plutonium? Is it gelorium? What can we use in this pulverizer? Oh, sulfur and pulverized tin, we can make gelorium? Then why the hell do we even bother with the turbine? Wow, I didn't you know you can make gelorium that easy. Wow, that's almost cheating. Plutonium dust. Well, we're gonna try to build this uh, reactor anyway, for funsies. I mean... Uh, except that I have no fucking clue what I'm doing. Okay, let's get back to crafting. I think we need more coolant ports. Let's make one coolant port. Uh, bucket, please. I'm gonna make one more coolant port and then where did we have the void? Ah oh, shit, shit, shit. Where are we avoiding liquids? I think it's over at the farm one, right? Let's take with the liquid board. Huh? Did I move it? Liquid crafter. Uh, where's that? Did I put it back in the system? Void. Yeah, okay, it's here. Let's try this a little. So let's go to the reactor. And I'm going to break this block to another coolant shit. Liquiduct. Fluid. Okay, you are gonna get hooked up there, there we go, get the buckets out of the way, what are you draining, that didn't work, oh what is that, I right clicked and it's turned to red, what's that shit? Oh, I'm emptying it. I only want to empty steam. So maybe I have to put the... Um... Okay, I understand. Now I understand how to get the steam out. Fill it up with water again. Oh, sorry. Why isn't it filling it up with water again? They're draining. Oh, he's also draining for some... So now the steam is getting 100 millibuckets. He's draining water, now he's draining steam. I'm getting steam back in. 
This is nothing. This doesn't make sense. So there is one way we can test this a little more. Deactivate the reactor. Can we break him? And we pick up the coolants we have placed here. Shit. Ah. Uh. need to throw in some random stuff here. Here's the indexer that we need to play around with later. I mean we don't have too much Crithium to go around. Okay, so we have moved, removed all Crithium from the reactor now. So is this gonna work better? One hundred. This does not make sense. Three thousand. I have no fucking clue what's going on. That seems completely broken. Maybe we'll just use a uh, Yellorium and build one more reactor. And we'll get the sulfur because we have a lot of sulfur. Well, we can build the. We can actually do like this. We hook up our reactor here somewhere. Probably it's gonna be longer. But we just finish it up here. Uh, somewhat, somehow. See how many more blocks we're gonna need. It's dropping water there. That's not the best looking thing. Alright. Meanwhile. Uh, well, shit. Input there, of course. 300, whoa, what happened there? 360 millibuckets. 120. Uh, I don't know. Let's build a smaller reactor first. A small turbine and see what happens. So let's get back to the reactor building. Alright, and this episode has been running long. So let's get up some more steel and finish. we're going to finish the turbine in the next episode. So if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and see you guys next time. Bye bye.